Hi, I'm Yipak from Indie Game Guides, and in this video I want to help you get a lot of bronze armor really quickly in Valheim. Now, once you kill Iktir, the very first boss, you can make your first mining pick from the antlers that he gives you. If you want some help with beating him, just check this guide out in the top right corner right about now. Once you've crafted your mining pick, you will want to go get a lot of copper and tin. Now, both can be found in the Black Forest biome, which is the next biome you should head over to. Now, copper are these big stones in the central area of the Black Forest, while tin are more smaller deposits you can find near water. Now, as these ores are very heavy, you can only mine so much, but I've got a trick around that. Now, little fact, when switching servers with your character, you will always keep everything in your backpack. Now, that's pretty cool, because that way, if you want to go play with a friend on another server, that way you can just bring your tools and weapons with you and you can just jump immediately into action. But this also works for everything in your backpack, including those ores. Another known fact is if you log off in a server and you log back on, you will always be still at the same position, even when you have two different servers. Now, what I did is I made a second server where my character is standing in front of a chest. Now, when my backpack is full on my regular server with ores, I will just log off, I will switch to the other server, place the ores in the chest and go back to my normal server to mine even more ore. When I'm done mining, I can just go back to my base, then I will go to the second server, I will take all the ores out of the chest and I will log off once again to my normal server and suddenly I find myself in my base with all the ore that I've collected. Because I even have no ores in my backpack, I can even use a portal to go from the Black Forest all the way back to my base. And the switching between servers even works when overcumbered. So what I want you to do is to make three antler pickaxes and go mining. Now the three antler pieces that you got from Aegtir, you will only need them to craft pickaxes, so you might as well just make them immediately. With your three antler pickaxes, you're going to go mining in the Black Forest. You're going to collect copper and tin as much as possible. Whenever your inventory is full, you will just put all your ores in the chest on the second server, switch back and return to mining. You're going to keep doing this until your picks are completely broken. Now, I personally went mining with a bronze pickaxe and three antler pickaxes. It took me about 30 minutes for them all to be broken. I headed back to my base, I switched to my server with all the ores, I brought it back to my base and it took me about 30 minutes to gather 87 copper ore and 67 tin ore. If you turn all that into bronze bars that will leave you with exactly 43 bronze bars for 30 minutes of work. Now I have to admit that it's not a complete bronze set but that is pretty damn close. Now, this is probably not how the game is intended to be played, but let's be honest, the entire system that they have now, not being able to portal with ores and stuff like that, is just mainly to increase your playtime and just forcing you to bring all the ores back with a cart that doesn't work over the terrain or just use a raft or a boat storage, which is not that much either. But now that you're finding yourself entirely into bronze armor, you may consider defeating the Elder, the second boss next. If you want help with that, or just regular other things like for example the taming of boars and wolves, getting specific weapon types, building bases, just check this playlist out. But guys, I want to thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.